if you have noticed strange activity on your WhatsApp, for example, messages marked as read when you didn't even open them, unknown devices linked to your account, or settings changing on their own, it's natural to wonder if someone else might be monitoring your chats. While WhatsApp uses end-to-end -end encryption, your account can still be accessed if someone has physical access to your phone, a linked device, or your verification codes. In today's video, I'll show you the key signs to look out for, how to check whether your WhatsApp is being monitored, and the exact steps you can take to secure your account immediately. Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Steph and in this channel, I teach you quick daily tech tips to make your life a little easier. Check your linked devices. The most common way someone might monitor your WhatsApp remotely is via the linked devices feature on WhatsApp web or your desktop. To check this, open WhatsApp. Tap on settings on the bottom right corner. Tap on link devices. Review all active sessions. If you see any device or browser that you don't recognize, tap on it and select Log Out. Secure physical access. If anyone has access to your phone, you can lock the app using Face ID. To do this, simply tap and hold onto the WhatsApp app and select Require Face ID. In this way, anyone who wants to access your WhatsApp will need to unlock the app using your registered Face ID. Enable two-step verification. This adds a critical layer of security by requiring a unique PIN whenever your phone number is registered with WhatsApp again, for example, on a new device. On your WhatsApp, tap on Settings. Tap on Account. Tap on Two-step verification. Tap on Turn On. Enter a unique six-digit PIN and remember it. Remember not to share this PIN with anyone. There you go. If you found today's video useful, do give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more useful videos like this. Until the next video, I'm Steph. Take care and bye-bye.